Come back to Father Solutions Academy. Encourage us to share our video, subscribe. If you have not subscribed before, kindly press the subscribe button. I want to work on uh, volume and total surface area of the bucket. Now, let me show you for bucket. This is how bucket look like. Now, this is a very good example of a bucket. I will find the volume of this and also find the total surface area of it. Total surface area, look at this. This is a circle. This is a circle. It means <laughs> I can call it a full stool. <laughs> It's a full stool, but as you see, it's a full stool. But the only problem is the complete is not complete. The what? The comb. Complete comb is not given. Now, how do I work on this particular area? That is what we are to work on as far as this video is concerned. Volume and total surface area of the bucket. Now, it's a very common part of a um, international exam, which you have been doing, you know. But Whenever you are asked to find something like this, note that total surface area of a bucket of a bucket will be equal to the marker is painting will be equals to now will be equals to okay will be equal to um, sum of curve part plus area of the of the bottom circle that is what we <coughs> are talking about and um, the volume will be equals to one third of pi h bracket of r big r squared plus big r small r plus r squared now look at what i mean here <coughs> this part is called big r this this part is called small r now the height from here to here, <coughs> this the height. This is not the height. Though. Hello, this is not the height. <coughs> Sorry, this is called slant height, which I've explained that the height is from here to here, which is what perpendicular distance. Now, um, that is what we are talking about on this video. Now, let me try to show one or two. I mean, let me show one example for better illustration. Permit me to write out the question. Okay, look at this question. Find the volume and the total surface area of the bucket 36 cm in the diameter at the top and 24 cm at the diameter. I mean, at the diameter at the bottom. The deep of the bucket is 30 cm. That is what we are talking about. This is the top. 34 centimeter. It means the diameter is what a line that cut the into two, which is maybe half of it will be the radius, which is maybe what 18, and also the down we have 24, half of it will be 12, and the height, which is deep, they said at the bottom, the deep of the bucket is 30 centimeter. Now, let me move on to the first one. Hello, we are also saying the same thing here. It can also come up in this form. This is a full stool of a, of a cone. Like this can become a full stool of a cone. Don't forget that. Full stool of a what? Of a cone. And um, but in, in, the, in the case of bucket, it will be like upside down, you know, to be up, upside down. And um, this is a very simple question that anybody can ask at any given time. Don't forget, if I were you, I would love to draw draw it. I would love to draw it like this. Don't mind my hand though. I'm not very good in drawing like that, but I'm trying anyway. Ah. Look at this. Can you see? And this will be after all this, sorry. 
Uh -huh. I've successfully dropped my bucket. Now, solution will be here. Hey, I need Macau sponsors. Come and sponsor me. Lord, help your boy. Now, I just need to work on that anyway. Now, the diameter of the top is what? Which is going to be what? Um, is um, Which is... We have 20... 36. Now, it means from here to here will be 18. Now, from here to here will be 18. Down will be what? 12. Is it 12? Yes, 24. It, since it's 24, it means it will be 12 centimeters. And the height, this is the height, which is the deep of the bucket is 30 centimeters. For you to get to this level, the question is half soft. The question is what? Half soft. Now, if I were you, total surface area, total surface area of the bucket will be equals to, now, material surface of area of the bucket will be equals to, now, we're talking about um, the sum of the, of the part, I mean, of the curve parts, the sum, of the curved these are curved part plus area of bottom circle. Now it means I'm talking about pi multiplied by height multiplied by uh, sum of radius or radia, it will become a radia plus area of the bottom now, which with a radius, when we have more than one radius, become a radius, which is R D I I radius. Now, I think I'll be having pi multiplied by 30 multiplied by. <coughs> now, radius will now be what? Uh, 18 plus 12 and uh, plus, which is plus, I'll be having area of the bottom. Area of the bottom will be pi r squared r squared will be pi 12 squared area of the bottom is you know area of the circle which is 12 squared now <clears throat> here will be 40 now it means i'll be having 10 that'll be 30 pi multiplied by 30 multiplied by 30 multiplied by 144 pi here will be 9000 pi plus 144 Pi, which I'll be having one nine thousand. That'll be one thousand forty four pi. Yes, one thousand forty four pi centimeter squared. That is the total surface area. Now, for me to find the volume of this particular shape, the volume volume of the bucket of the bucket. Will be equals to one third of pi h bracket of r squared plus r small plus that is the volume. Now it means I will be talking about one third of pi multiplied by thirty bracket of um, my r big r squared. We have eighteen squared plus 18 multiplied by 12 plus 12 squared now by so doing this 18 square will give me year one year 10 it means 10 pi bracket of uh 324 plus 216 plus 144 now which i'll be having this 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 it will give me 684 
multiply by 10 pi. Now, which I'll be having 6,840 pi centimeter cube. That is just it. That is just it. Can you see? That is just it. Now, question can come in this form. Don't forget that if you become a cutoff of a, uh, of a, of a cone, and uh, whatever you have to do, you have to get it also. Take note of this thing and uh, you'll be fine with it. I think with this, you are good to go. You have no problem with any solid shape. If at all you have any problem, you can contact us. Don't forget to share and subscribe. Once again, thanks for watching.